Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and this is the look at what's for the Patch Tuesday updates for Windows 11. They're slightly different than Windows 10 so we'll be looking at Windows 11 most of the time um, separately. Um, Windows 10 contained only Patch Tuesday security fixes. Um, in Windows 10 there was 22 flaws that were fixed, one zero day, no critical. In Windows 11, it's uh, all 23 flaws, so one more security vulnerability than Windows 10. The zero day is there, but no critical, once again, for Windows 11 also, which means harder to exploit. You have to have access to the machine in some way in order to exploit those, but they are important, so it's very important to still apply and make sure that you update with the security updates. If you check your updates for Windows 11, you'll see that it comes in the form of a cumulative update and the number of the KB, um, the uh, update itself is KB5010386. It also fixes two little things. Um, one is a fix for a, um, a bug that uh, is happening in um, the uh, LDAP protocol, uh, which is the lightweight directory access protocol. Uh, so apparently there was a little something there that could actually have problems. Uh, but for most users, what is the biggest fix is Windows Update itself as a servicing stack update that will improve reliability of the Windows Update on Windows 11. So uh, that is probably good news. And uh, if you want to know what version you should be after this update, Winver will tell you that you are and should be at, as of today, February 8th, uh, 22,000.493. That is the latest version of Windows 11 for regular users. And of course, I will probably have this asked quite a lot. One of the things that we know is it, it's, it is installing on unsupported hardware, so you guys are going to be up to date without any problems, even if you're using an unsupported machine on Windows 11. So uh, up, go to uh, your Windows update and install them. If you don't, well, it will install automatically within the next hours or so. And uh, this will keep you safe with Windows 11. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.